We don't want our local community theater to die. It's why we did this and took on all of this extra stuff. Is it rare right now for people to actually be able to go experience something like theater, like what you guys are offering? Really rare. Honestly, I, I don't know how many people are, I, I would bet we're one of just a handful of people in the state actually doing a live performance. So you're, you're, you're directing the, the Marvelous Wonderettes. What's it about? What's that show about? It's about four girls that are part of the Glee Club and they get asked to be the entertainment for their senior prom because the boy Glee Club got in trouble for smoking. I hope that people understand that, you know, we've done the best we can to mitigate all health directives and, and, and handle that responsibly. Our performers are actually gonna wear face shields and we're all outside now. There's a big, big, big lawn that, that we're going to be spray painting like audience boxes, like circles on the lawn where they purchase tickets, they come in, they have to stay in their box. What has it meant to you to be able to like dive into to, to theater in the midst of all this, just to kind of get back into it? Just, I, I don't even know how to vocalize that. I, it, it was to the point where I, I offered to do it for free. <laughs> I'm grateful for every pain in the rear, directive we had to follow. I'm grateful for every hot, sweaty mask rehearsal I've done. I'm grateful for all of it. I love it. Well, the show Shaboom! Life Could Be a Dream is now running through tomorrow at Central Lakes College in Brainerd. And the Marvelous Wonderettes runs August 3rd through the 6th. Tickets go on sale on site an hour before each show.